After creating the business layer components, a query can be used within the tool to test objects, verify the SQL, and preview results. In this tutorial, you will create and execute a query using objects from a multi-source business layer. Note that this tutorial was recorded using SAP Business Objects Information Design Tool 4.0, version 14.0.0, v2010-1019-0760. To navigate, use the viewer controls or follow the on-screen instructions, if available. Create a new query in the business layer. Click Queries. Click Insert Query. Add objects from the three different data sources to the query. Click plus to expand the customer, oracle folder. Click plus to expand the customer folder. Double click the last name dimension. Click plus to expand the sales, SQL server folder. Click plus to expand the sales folder. Double click the invoice date dimension. Click plus to expand the club, MS access folder. Click plus to expand the country folder. Double click the country dimension. Preview the data. Click refresh. View the generated SQL. Click view script. In the generated SQL syntax, tables and columns are prefixed by the catalog name, customer, sales, and club, followed by the owner, depending on the RDBMS. This format helps the Data Federator query server retrieve the data from the different RDBMS data sources. Exit the query SQL script and run the query. Click OK. Click OK. Click Execute Query. The last name, invoice date, and country values of the three different data sources are displayed. Close the tab and return to the business layer view. Click Close. Click Save. You have successfully created and executed a query using objects from a multi-source business layer. This is the end of the tutorial.